Downtown is almost over. One more day until the NFL season opener. Emily Deem is getting us in the football spirit this morning. She joins us live from that club on this morning. Hi, Em. Would it just get here already? Yeah. Oh, my gosh, you guys. I'm just so excited. I can't wait. Tomorrow, NFL kickoff concert and the season opener. Are you excited? Because I'm just a little excited. And you know what else is exciting? To see this enormous stage in the background because this is where you know Kid Rock, Lady Annabella, Maroon 5 are going to be rocking out but also what thousands of fans are going to be rocking out too you can come down here see them and what the NFL is telling you get here early because it's a first come first serve kind of concert you're going to want to get out here Christine Mills is here to talk to us about that director of events for the NFL good morning good morning okay we hear a lot of noise in the background too I just wanted to point something out take a look over there we've got some workers out here this early this morning they're doing something to keep some fans safe tell us about that oh we're just removing some guardrails and asphalting uh, a ramp so when people uh, make their way into the stadium after the concert or to the surrounding local establishments after the concert they'll be safe well let's go ahead and talk about that concert the big nfl kickoff concert that's happening tomorrow um, let's go ahead and tell where fans can go which area they need to go into if they want to come out here for the concert so fans uh, can enter the site at 315 uh, the main entry is off of Armed Forces and Holmgren and fans will uh, enjoy themselves and they'll be part of uh, the kickoff celebration as you mentioned and enjoy performances by Lady Antebellum, Maroon 5 and Kid Rock. And you say get here early. Yeah, we, we will we'll be able to uh, accommodate multiple fans as you just mentioned. Uh, We'll be prepared for you, and we're we're excited to welcome the fans of of the Packers. The fans we've been working with the local officials, uh, working with the village, working with the city, working with the county, local law enforcement, uh, and we are excited to put on a great show. And quick, some fun facts that we have for people. Oh, some fun facts. We have over a mile of eight foot fencing in and around the site. We have over a hundred, a thousand actually bike rides barricades. Uh, we have over 200 uh, lights in and around the site as you see behind us uh, on stage and surrounding the site. How exciting you know for people to come here to see this to have this in our area. Uh, a few restrictions though that people there are some things that people can't bring in a few examples of that a few examples of that uh, are food and beverage. Please do not bring food and beverage into the site. Um, however, we will make uh, food and beverage available uh, for purchase. Uh, we also ask that you don't bring umbrellas. We ask that you do not bring bags over 12 inches. Uh, a list of prohibited items is listed on NFL.com and uh, will also be released later today. All right, great, Christine. Thanks so can much, I bring you a guys. Chair? Can she bring? Can Rachel bring a chair? <laughs> no chairs. Rachel, no chairs. Everybody has to stand. Uh, Standing question. Great question. No chairs. <laughs> Standing only. Oh well. But when you see a thing that says "Back to Football," I guess I would stand anywhere to watch a concert that has Maroon Five, Lady Antebellum, and Kid Rock. So we can't wait. And hey, everybody, I'm going to be up on that stage hosting it with Average Joe from WIXX. So. What are you going to ask Kid Rock? I think I'm going to be too nervous to ask him anything. He'll probably walk up with his hat, his long hair, and I'll just kind of stand there. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I know. Well, I'll think of some questions tonight. Yeah, this is cool stuff. Hey, Emily, could you do us a favor? Um, Rachel chained her um, lawn chair to the fence over there. She thought she could get a, a place. Could you just bring it back when you come back? Yeah, I'll definitely bring it back. Um, is it unlocked, Rachel, or am I going to have to like tear it off of a fence? You'll have to tear it off. Oh, yeah. Right. Okay, thanks. Okay.